Did you know you can schedule a text message to send later? Well, spoiler alert, you can. But you can also do a whole lot more in Google Messages. So these are the best hidden Google Messages features. Hey friends, I'm Tasia Custody and welcome back to my YouTube channel where I share tech tips, app reviews, and a metric ton of Google tips. And today I'm sharing 10 hidden Google messages features. So are you ready? Then let's go. So let's kick things off with hidden feature number one. Use Google Smart Reply to reply to messages without actually having to type anything. So from your Google Messages app, tap the menu icon and then head to your settings. Now from here, tap on suggestions and simply enable the suggestions you wanna use. So mine are auto enabled, but you can choose between assistant suggestions and then here is the smart reply I'm referring to. This is really similar to Gmail and Google's predictive response feature. But also from here, you have the option to toggle on or off the suggested actions and stickers. So with smart reply toggled on, now when you go to reply to that text, you're gonna have suggestions that you can send without even typing. All right, number two on the list, block and report spam. So our phones do a pretty good job of filtering out a lot of spam calls and messages, but I find some messages still get through. Luckily with Google Messages, you've got some added spam support. So from your messages app, tap the more button on the top to head back to your settings and this time select spam protection. If this is not toggled on, you're definitely gonna want to enable it here. You can also block and report individual messages should one actually get through even with this on. So from the chat that's spam, tap on the more icon and choose details. Then just select block and report spam. Okay, number three on the list is to pin conversations. Yes, the same feature that's found in iMessages is found in Google Messages too. So for those that are your favorites, you can simply tap and hold the conversation to select it, and then tap the pin icon in the top toolbar. This is gonna move that conversation up to the top of the screen, effectively pinning it to the top for easy access. The fourth hidden Google Messages feature is to easily make the font bigger. This is great if you have a hard time reading the tiny text. From a chat, simply pinch out on the screen to increase the text size. And you can of course pinch back in to make it small again. This is just like you're used to doing to zoom into a picture, but you're doing it within your messages. And this just affects your chat, not every other app on your phone. Okay, number five on the list is to quickly share your location with others. Now this is similar to how you can do so on Google Maps as well. So this hidden feature is found within the specific chat itself. Simply tap on the plus icon near the keyboard and then just tap on the location icon. So from here, you can either search for a location to send or you can send your current location. The next hidden feature is to mark messages to easily find them later. Yes, in Google Messages, you will actually have a specific storage location for starred messages. So if you need to remember the details of a message someone sent you, maybe it's a website, a picture, a location, whatever it is, you can just tap and hold that specific message and then tap the star icon from the top toolbar. Now to easily find starred messages, you're just gonna tap the more button and select starred. If you've starred a lot of messages, you can even search here in the top search bar to easily find your messages. And now we've come to the part of the video where if you're still watching, number one, thank you so much. And number two, remember to give this video a like and subscribe to my channel for even more content like this. I'd be so appreciative. And now on with the show. Moving on to number seven on my list of the best hidden Google Messages features is to use Google Messages on the web. That's right, just like you can do with WhatsApp, you can do with Google Messages. To do so, you'll first wanna to head to the Google Messages website, and I've got the link for that in the description below. Then from your phone, you're gonna open up the Messages app and tap on more options at the top, 
and then select device pairing. Tap the QR code scanner and use your phone to scan the code on the web. It's really that easy. Coming in at number eight, did you know that you can archive messages? So rather than deleting them forever and then they're gone, you can actually just store them away. So from your list of chats, tap and hold on a chat that you'd like to archive. Once you hold down on a chat, you can select the archive button from that top toolbar. This will move that chat to your archive section. So to access the archived messages, you just head to the three dot menu icon and then select archived. By the way, if you wanna move a chat out of the archives and back to your main list, you can do that too. So once again, you'll tap and hold on the combo you wanna unarchive, and this time tap the unarchive option. And before I get into one of my most favorite hidden Google Messages features, let's talk about number nine on the list, dark mode. You actually have a few options in Google Messages when it comes to dark mode. And might I add, a great accessibility feature. So from your Messages app, head back to the More icon and tap on Choose Theme. Here, you may already be set to System Default, which will automatically switch between Light and Dark Mode on the OS settings change. Now, this is my preferred theme, but if you want, you can toggle on Dark to be Dark Mode all the time. And we have come to the end of the road. Coming in at number 10 is one of my favorite Google Messages features of all time. You can schedule a message to send later. Yes, just like you can in Gmail, you can with Google Messages too. I know. So all you have to do is type out the message that you wanna send, but instead of just hitting send, tap and hold the send option to the right. A pop-up menu will appear and from here, you can choose the date and time you'd like to send your message. Once you pick your preferred time, simply tap on the send message icon to schedule the message. Now, if you decide you actually don't wanna send the message after all, or maybe you need to edit it, you can simply tap the clock icon to the left of that scheduled message. And from here, you can either edit it, send it now instead, or just delete the message altogether. Can you believe that's a what? A game changer. But guess what? There are even more hidden Google Messages features. They were cut for time because we'd be here all day if we went over them all. So if you want to know even more hidden Google Messages features, let me know in the comments below and I'll make another video for you. So those are my favorite hidden Google Messages features. What do you think of these top tens? Let everyone know in the comments below. As always, thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, well, I wanna know. So give it a like, a share, or leave that comment below. You can click right about here to subscribe to my channel. And of course, here and here for even more Google content. Thanks so much for watching. See you next time.